I know you could do it. Hey guys, welcome to Mommy Monday. So it's just Matt and myself today. And we're doing something so fun. We're going to run a Tough Mudder. Now, I've been training for this all year. And as you guys know, in February I hurt my back. So I have not been training at all really the last, you know, month or and a half. So I'm hoping this is good for me. It's gonna be great for Matt because he's been working his tail off. And we have this classroom. We have like the coolest friends we've made. So we're gonna run together with them. And anyway, we're gonna have a really fun time. So we're gonna take you guys along with us. We got up way earlier than normal for today's Tough Mudder. I'm proud of myself. <laughs> Cause it's really hard for me to wake up early. I'm just tired. So luckily we got an early start today because we arrived at the location. And when we got there, it was kind of a dead end in the middle of a neighborhood with a locked gate showing the road we needed to go down, but we couldn't actually go down the road. So two other cars pull up, they're also lost. So now we're all caravanning a different way to get to the same spot. So if this was the amazing race, we would definitely be losing. But we're having fun. We're almost there. <laughs> we made it, you guys. We finally made it. See, there's people out there. There's human life. You ready, Matt? Yeah, with my pink fanny pack, how can I not oh, be ready? Oh, you look really cool. The first obstacle is a giant hill. There's also some other really hard ones. I'm hoping I can do it, and I also hope I don't hurt myself. Trying to do it, yeah, there's the first one. That giant hill up there. And this is a big hill. Here we go. I just want to find out that I'm ahead of my team right now. This is probably the only time it's going to happen all day. Hey, we're oh my about gosh. To... Now we're going down a hill. Everyone's like sliding down. Hopefully we don't. Oh, someone biffed it down there. Here we go. We got this. We got it, honey. Main end of the hill. <laughs> that is a steep hill we're doing. You guys are viewing over there too. We made it to the top of the world's tallest hill, practically. Oh my gosh, More it was like really mountain, hard. Yeah, it's a mountain. Mm -hmm. But there's a good view up here. I mean, it is pretty. The Christine got a little bit of dirt on her rear end. <laughs> okay, we're going down this really steep hill now. Christine's gonna slide, and I'm gonna try and walk. Hopefully I don't slip. Looks like you're having a lot of fun sliding, though. Oh gosh, are you all right? You got this. Next, we are going to be doing this. I was so you thinking, just have to go through the water? Oh, is it okay? Okay, wait for me, wait for oh, me. Oh, gosh, we're good. getting our shoes wet. Here we go. Ah! Oh, ah! get deeper. Oh, <laughs> oh gosh, it's up so to deep, my thigh. Honey. It's up to my thigh, look at it. Oh gosh. <laughs> <laughs> I can't do it! Don't give me something touching me. <laughs> you never know what could be down there when you can't see the bottom. <laughs> oh no! Oh great! Oh. So we just went down this huge hill and now we've got to go up this. Show off! <laughs> So we have to crawl under this huge net up here. There you go. Woo! Made it. Well, this looks like fun. I'm excited about this. Although, usually it means there's probably something really hard to have. Shaded, I like it. Yeah, we could camp out in here, it's nice. Ready for this? I'm ready. Alright, here we go. This is an up and over obstacle. I'm going. Go. Oh, Ow, my pinky. Yeah. Okay, help me up. Good job. <laughs> And I am 
bleeding, so I'm gonna get some medical. Dane's getting treated for her little cut. They're putting ice in the water. Oh, my gosh. There's barbed wire. So you have to go under it. I think I see people flush stuck to the barbed wire. <laughs> I'm gonna sit this one out because... Sorry, oh, you're scared? Okay. I'm not sitting out because I'm scared. I'm sitting out because I don't want to hurt my back. So I'm kind of being careful right now. Oh. Okay, babe, you got this. You're almost done. Oh, you're using muscles I didn't even know existed. <laughs> All right, here we go through a bunch more mud. Whoa, Whoa that's water. slippery. That's the bad part. I cheated. <laughs> Look at that, though. Who wants to walk through that? This one's going to be fun. Got this super train going on. Uh, good job, man. I got you with additional support. Just get closer. This is real teamwork Bring right here. Come on. 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 Come on! Come on. Come on. Come on. Got this, Christine. You got it. Come on! Come on. You got it. Grab the shoulder. Come on! Come on. Yeah! Come on! Come on. Yeah. You did it! I could have done it. I knew you could do it. Come on! Come on! Yeah, you did it! <laughs> Obstacle seven. Hey, I didn't take the biggest one, but that's all right. We're not here to prove our toughness. We're here to survive. Good job. Was that easy? Nailed it. So now we're on a track of some sort. It's like curves, so you could drive fast if you were in a car. Okay, this one looks fun, but the truth is it's kind of hard. No, no, I can't do it. You got it. Okay, I'm not doing it. No. <laughs> I'm not in the physical shape to do this kind of stuff. Matt's gonna do it with a different partner so they can do it. Oh, good job. Oh, that's tricky. Look at that. So we're catching up to some other racers. We're feeling good about stuff. And it looks like we're about to go into some kind of pink looking water here. There you go. Yay! Good job. You ready to get in? Suddenly the sun disappears, so I feel like it's gonna be cold. Oh god. That's ah, freaking freezing. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh, it's cold. <laughs> oh, they're already turning it. It's cold. It's cold. It's cold. You go and then I'll go next time. Just grab that leg. There you go. Spin around and grab that leg. Go back. Go back. I'm going to push down. I'm going to go ahead. You got it. You got it. I got it. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> right. Two, two, three, go. Jump, hold. Now you hold on. Keep holding on. Go, go, go. One more. There we go. We got it. Spin around. Spin around. Oh, gosh. I took a nose dive. Go, go, go. There you go. Let's push. You got this. You got this. We're getting the ball here. Come on. Go, go, go. Ball, ball, ball. 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 Ball, ball
awesome. There we go. Woo. You got it. Oh, that was good. fun. That cold water felt so good. This next one is like a warped wall with no ledge to grab onto. So Matt's going to take one for the team on this one. <laughs> hey, there's no guarantees, but you can do it. Go, Matt. Oh, look at you. All right. You're going to jump. He's going to jump down the whole thing. He's going to go one, two. Just kidding. All right, Matt's doing the last obstacle. It's not easy. Got it. <laughs> Here we go. That's a pretty long drop down. <laughs> it's like a, about a 40 foot drop down there. A tough mutter. I didn't have to throw my shoes away. Yeah, we didn't really get that dirty, but we did get really, really wet. And I, my hair got kind of gross. I tried to wash it with the water there, but you can see it's pretty gross. That was a lot of fun. I would definitely do a tough mutter again. Yeah, I would too. That was pretty cool. I cannot wait to do something else cool like this. Uh oh, I think we're getting lost. Mm -hmm. Yep, here we are on the freeway. Why is it splitting here? Who's a fork at the beginning of a freeway ramp? Um, let's see here. This just goes along with the whole day of getting lost. So we're going to just go get a bite to eat, maybe waste a little more time while we're alone, but we're excited to get home and see the kids. I want to show them all the pictures. I think they're going to be super excited to see all of this. Especially because they're doing their own kids' Tough Mudder in a couple of weeks. That's right. We signed them up for a Tough Mudder for kids. It looks so cool. And the great thing is parents can go free. So we can run with the kids on their Tough Mudder. But I am so excited to see them do this. I feel like Zach and Chris and Michael and David are going to just be like so excited. <laughs> we're starting to rethink our idea of doing this Tough Mudder. <laughs> because we're walking and I'm like, I'm like wobbling. I'm like, oh my gosh, I'm so sore. We didn't even sit down that long in the car oh, and stand up. And we're super stiff. Our backs hurt. Yes. Our knees hurt. My knees hurt. We're not old. Not Although my legs do hurt. <laughs> Food's ready. Buffalo burger. Yay. It's almost weird because we have no kids. I caught him during a bite. That wasn't awkward. <laughs> No, but for real, I'm place eating with the kids. I'm like, man, this is kind of boring. <laughs> Seems too quiet in here. I know. <laughs> I keep looking around, like wondering, where's all the noise? Where's the kids fighting? Where's hey, they the don't fight. Under the tables, on the tables. They don't climb under or on the tables. Where's Michael spilling his drink? <laughs> okay, that happens. <laughs> well, since our kids don't want us to come home yet, I guess they're having fun without us. We're gonna go walk around the mall and like look for birthday presents for the kids and stuff. We do have a lot of birthdays coming up in our family. It's really hard trying to pick out what I think my kids would like. So we're just walking along, wasting time. Yeah. <laughs> we got sidetracked. We were shopping for the kids and then we saw some cool adult stuff. It's down to 29 bucks. Uh -oh. I was about to buy something here for Michael because he loves this character here and that guy there. But they're $49.99. That was way 
you do lunch? Well, our shopping trip was successful. I got David some pretty cute stuff for his birthday. Also got Michael a couple of things. And now we're sort of slowly heading home so we don't disturb the party going on. But we're making our way there. Hi, baby. Hi. Did you miss mama? Hi. Hi. I missed you. Oh, you're trying to escape. Is he, he not letting you escape? So I woke up this morning and I was excited to see how I would feel after running the Tough Motor yesterday. And the great news is I feel fantastic. I'm so happy because I think that means I'm finally on the upswing from all of this back injury stuff that's been going on. So I'm really excited. Anyway guys, I have to give a shout out to one of our fans. You guys can go to my Facebook page to see this, but we had the most adorable post that was posted on our Facebook page this week. So one of our little fans went to her mom and was asking if she could make one of the recipes that we had made on Kid Size Cooking. And she went ahead and made the chicken fettuccine Alfredo recipe that we just did with Chris recently. And she nailed it, you guys. I'm so happy. We were all super excited when we saw the picture. So I wanna thank you, Zoe, for posting your daughter's picture and tell her we absolutely loved it. She nailed it. And anybody else who makes our recipes, definitely post pictures so we can see them and share them. So now we're gonna answer some questions that you guys submitted to us. Don't forget to submit your comments, questions, hidden pineapple comments, and all that kind of stuff on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. And the first question is regarding the house. How finished is the house? And are we gonna do a tour? The house is like 99% finished. The yard is about 2% finished. And yes, we're going to do a tour. Faith wants to know if you guys have your own iPads or if you share. We have our own. Yeah. Yeah. Yep, they used to share. Mommy and Daddy had one and we gave the two iPads to the kids and they all shared. But we realized that they are great for road trips and other stuff, so everybody has their own. The next question is, what are your fears? Ooh, green peas. David, you're scared of green peas? Yeah. You know what? <laughs> I know what David's scared of. What? Getting beaned with a baseball. Yeah. Okay. Ever since he got beaned with the baseball, he's yeah. a little nervous at the plate. If you guys missed that, it was in last week's episode. We showed the pitcher bean David in the leg. Yeah, that was right here. Yeah, so that's David's fear, I would say. One time, the same kind of thing happened. Like, I got hit with a soccer ball in the face. That's why I always like, oh. Michael, what are you scared of? Mosquitoes and mosquitoes. Heather? Mosquitoes. I, I hate them. <laughs> okay, they're both afraid of mosquitoes. I know what Owen's afraid of. What? Yeah. Mosquito also? Oh, yeah. He says, yeah. We showed him one on the security camera, and he all, he, like, he's like, oh, and he ran away. Aww. He did not like it. <laughs> so Owen doesn't like bugs either, huh? <laughs> Eliana wants to know, Alyssa, what's the favorite drawing that you've ever drawn? This is definitely one of my favorite ones because it's so cute and I love birds. And also, speaking of this, I love it so much. I did. I'm gonna have a tutorial on my YouTube channel. So you yep. Have to go check it out. She's gonna show you guys how to draw this on her channel pretty soon. It's gonna be awesome. I like this owl a lot. And this is one of the first ones I ever did. It's a fox. And another fox. <laughs> cute little tool. So Alyssa likes drawing real-looking animals. Yep. David, what's your favorite drink? I like the root beer at Blaze Pizza. Because it's like homemade? Yeah. Zach, what's your favorite fruit? Strawberries. Chris, what is your shoe size? Um, he doesn't know. Four. Yeah, yeah, he's around a four. Hey. Michael, what's your favorite Disney movie? Uh, Star Wars and Pirates and the Greatest Showman. Lila said she loves your channel and she wants to know your favorite movie. So Michael just answered that. He said his, and what's everybody else's? Greatest Showman. Yeah, if I had to choose a favorite movie, it would probably be Greatest Showman. Because it has so many good songs. I love Madagascar. I also like Journey to the Center of the Earth and the Thura. The next question is, what are your favorite seasons? The winter. I like summer. Winter and summer. I mean, Definitely yeah, summer. Summer. Summer, we could spend. So we all actually like summer. Yeah. <laughs> I like spring. Daniela was wondering from a couple episodes ago about the allergies the kids were having and what specifically was going on with Alyssa. She was kind of having like a grass allergy. It was really weird 
and it got really severe to the point that there was like sores on her face. It was crazy, it lasted a couple weeks and it was gone and she's better now because she's on medication for the allergies, so she's good. Valentina wants to know what your favorite subject is in school. I like science, math, and geography. Art. I love learning about animals. Awesome. Poor little Michael, he was a little bit sick, so if you're wondering why he doesn't look so happy, it's because he is a little bit sick again. Poor Michael. Thanks for watching. Congratulations to this week's Fans of the Week. You found a hidden pineapple. <laughs> Were you able to find the hidden pineapple in today's video? If you did, be sure to leave a comment with the hashtag hidden pineapple so we can choose you for Fan of the Week.